Alrighty, so I just want to do my quick little video review of Outdoor Life polo shirts sold by Sears. Um, the reason I got these, um, I use them for work exclusively. So I basically wear them once, twice a week and wash them every time. So they go through a lot of washes. Um, I want something that looks decent for work. I don't want to spend a lot of money like Armour, uh, Under Armour, or any of those other shirts. Um, these shirts are like $15 versus say 40 for Under Armour and that's shopping online. Um, these are just the price. They don't need a, I don't need a special sale or anything, you know, just 15 bucks about and you can get them. Some things about these texture. Now they do have a couple different models. Get the ribbed one. Um, they seem to last better. I did get a, another, another style that was more. Like this Dockers or Polo shirt, or uh, it's either Dockers or Hagar, I'm not sure. I'm going to use this shirt in as, as an example. It's too sheen or smooth, I don't know what word you want to call it. But um, both those style shirts, they actually don't do well for being washed weekly and going through a lot of use. Um, they're pretty heavy material, but they, they're not hot. I'm indoor and outdoor a lot. They're, they're thick, but they're they're not, I guess because they're polos, they're not really hot. I don't know. It's, they're not like the uh, air wicky ones, but they work fine. Um, there was another point I was going to bring up about these shirts. Oh, yeah, wrinkle-free. So you don't have to iron shirts like these. That's a major thing. Um definitely don't want to add ironing to my daily routine so that's a no-no now if you look over here at this shirt again this is either a Dockers or a Hagar and one thing to notice the logo wore off and I wore this shirt one one twentieth of the amount of time I wore these shirts because I like them so the logo wore off okay um, where the belt line is, you can't really see it, but it's all frayed. Um, I don't know, it's, it's just not a, a super strong material, and the shirt was more money. Now, I'll tell you something interesting about these shirts. So I just got the shirt on the right in the mail. The shirt on the left has been washed about 170 times, if that tells you anything. See the logo? It's starting to crack a little bit, but then compare it to a brand new one. But you really can't tell the difference. This shirt has been sitting on the floor, so if you see anything on it, I'm getting ready to donate it. And it's not because the shirt's bad. I'm just tired of looking at it. I know when I buy a, a lot of shirts, I'll buy like six, seven shirts, and then I just dump the old ones. And here's a brand new one right next to it. The buttons didn't fall off, nothing like that. The colors on the video are gonna be off just, just the way it is. These shirts are actually dark, dark navy. I don't know how they're coming through on the camera. It looks a little light on the screen. But, I mean, these shirts actually look good enough to wear out. I mean, throw on some slacks and a, and a polo shirt. I don't think anyone's gonna know that the shirt is not Gucci or whatever you think is fancy. Uh, really comfortable I think you can't go wrong with them and again I generally don't have good luck with name brand stuff for work I consider myself like a heavy user of whatever I use I buy the same shoes the same shirts the same pants and I just buy like 10 of them and just use them and use them and use them and that's what I like so again outdoor life on Sears directly from Sears Sometimes it's going to be a pain, and I don't know how these people handle the stocking of clothes, but it's probably why they're almost out of business. You know, I, I took the label of one of these, went to the store, went to a Sears store, and they couldn't figure out, you know, what shirt I wanted, which was pretty ridiculous. And I spent, like, months looking for a different kind of shirt, and then I ended up finding these back online again. So... I mean, good luck finding them, but those are the ones to look for. Thanks.